I'ma tell you this is a fact. No one will tell you, but are we? If this discipline, economics, if you don't choose it, if it chooses you, like you be in the department, if it is by chance, you are going to struggle, especially for your first year on campus. It's a must. You need more than just admission to actually scale through the hurdles of academic excellence. It's the fact. Admission is what gives you a ticket to sit in the class. It's not what transforms the entire journey of academics into success. Excellence is what everybody has at their reach. But the point of it is, you've got to choose what you want to excel on. Every woman be have to make that choice. There's no success by chance. All right, you might want to tell me that there's a man, there's a woman who wanted to study law and they gave him an economics and he ended up graduating with the best graduating student in the school, he ended up graduating with the first class, he ended up graduating with the best student in the set. Let me tell you the truth. Ask them, they will tell you. Their first year was a mess. But at some point in time, they get to ask themselves, okay, fine, I'm going to choose to do my best. Now, until you are willing to actually make that decision yourself, to choose to do your best, you can't pay the price. Because the point of it is, academic excellence comes from truth discipline. When they grade you at the end of the semester, what that result is telling you is how diligent you are for the whole, for the whole semester. It's not really telling you how intelligent you are. You know, so many of you out there like, wow, what do I need a grade for? I just want to own my boutique shop. I just want to be this and that. But the obvious point is if you are so, so undiligent in something as simple as they taught you in class, just reproduce what they taught you in the examination. Don't you for a time think of when will you ever engage your brain? Because what you don't understand is that unlike real life, academics will tell you what you need. You go to exam, you write. And it tells you the result. But real life is this. You can keep failing in real life without really knowing that you are failing. But the point is, you failing. That's just the obvious point. Why you need to cultivate a self-evaluating discipline is within the world, the zone of academics.